In this world turned graveyard, every footstep is a calculated dance between life and death. I've become a wanderer in a land of ghosts, driven not just by the need to survive, but by the hope that my family might still be out there. I move with caution, weaving through the ruins of cities and the skeletal remains of once vibrant communities. The journey is a solitary one, and the road home is paved with uncertainty. But the possibility, however faint, that my family endures becomes the unyielding force driving me forward. Okay, everybody, welcome to the story of Sam. This is our main character, Samantha. We are in Polonia. We just got through looting Polonia. This is where we left off last time, but I went ahead and looted a few houses. I didn't do everything because Sam has pretty much what she needs, but we're going to hit back the red trail here. And um, let me get my gun in hand. Which one gun do I want to have? Is it a... Uh... Yeah, let's get this gun in hand. We're working our way down south. If you've never seen uh, the story of Sam, our main character, Samantha, has been working her way all the way from North Livonia, near Lacau or Laco and working her way down south to try to find where her father uh, house is so we're going to try to work our way and we're getting pretty close to where so we might be able to find uh, where we need to go in this episode and hopefully we'll be able to find where her family is if you haven't already make sure to uh, subscribe I can't remember, I think the last I looked, we're at almost at 240 subscribers. So thank everyone who has subscribed. And uh, if you haven't joined uh, the Discord, I got the Discord going. So, um, and, and I'm new to learning how to use Discords. But I mean, I've got a pretty good start. So we can get in there and chat. All right. I'm going to follow the red trail as far as I can. Oh, there's a bunker up there, right? No, is that bunkers? That just rocks. And I have no stamina because I got the plate carrier and I got so much gear. Looks like you gotta be careful. Make sure no bears. They look like a bear cave right there. I don't want to run into any bears. Hang on, I'll make sure. Yeah. All right, I had to check something real quick, make sure it was working right. I had trouble with my audio earlier. It's really finicky, my um, sound mixer. If you turn it up, you turn up the gain just too much, then it gets distorted. Not enough, can't hear anything I'm saying. So I really need to get a new one probably. All right, no rain as of right now. Okay, there's the red trail. There's the red. Oh, there's a dirt road coming up here. Whoa. Oh, yeah. That is, is that the military base? There is a military base that I don't... I think we're going to go around. I don't think we need to go to it. I'm not too familiar. That might be it. I don't know. It looks pretty cool. Those, is that a big radio tower or something? I can't tell, but that looks really cool. We're going to keep following the red trail, though. really like the way Livonia looks. Doesn't that sky look really nice? I think that's with the new update. They updated the sky. Um, I don't know if you've seen, but as I'm recording this, it was just a couple of days ago where DayZ released um, their next expansion coming out later this year. Uh, I don't know, Frostline? I know it's, uh, they're, they're implementing snow and a new area and new other new things, uh, which I am great. Anything, any updates they want to do, uh, you know, that's great because that means that they're actually spending work and time into developing the game and it's already 10 years old. So uh, I think it's great to keep, to keep development, keep improving. I mean, there's some really good custom maps up there, but I would like to see some good official Daisy maps. Might have to check my map. Okay, this is a dirt road. 
We're staying on the red trail, crossing the dirt road. We're trying to make our way. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce the name of the town. I think it's. Let me let's look. Let me look at my map real quick. All right. I know this map is hard to see. It's down south. Where are we at? It? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, this map is so hard to see because the 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 writing on the the name of the towns is in white, and I can't see it. I think it's called yeah. Here it is. The very south is called Do Dolink Dolinka. So that's where we're trying to head to. It's oh, put the map up. Put the map up, Sam. Come on, Sam. Could be bears in these woods. You, don't, you ain't gonna fight a bear with a map. But yeah, it'll be fun to see when that out. I, I know they said later 2024, but I didn't. I don't remember what the date. And here we are. This is tricky. Oh, so the red trail turns into a road because there's another sign right there. The red, you know, sticker. So. Oh no, this is confusing. Where does the red trail go? Well, if that's not confusing, so. There is a sticker there. I don't know, what do you think? If you see that on that tree I think it makes me think so I need to go up, right? Well, let's go up a little way, see if we can figure out the red trail comes back. If not, I'm sure we'll find a road and we'll figure out how to get back to it. Yep, look at that. Did we make the right choice? Because there's another sign on the tree. So I think we made the right choice. If you saw, um, I posted the video of that Namaus PVP tournament I was in. That was actually, it was a lot of fun. I was actually, I've been sick for when I, I first started getting sick when I did that tur tournament. And then I got sick worse. But um, it was a lot of fun. That was my first tournament to be in. And uh, I'm trying to get into the next one, but... Right now, I'm just on the reserve list, so I'm not sure if I'm going to make it. But uh, it was a lot of fun to do that. I, I didn't get any kills or anything, but it was fun just to get the experience. Okay. I don't know what we got going up here, but there's a big tank and there's a big tower. So are we coming up on a military thing? Is this... Oh, this is the... Uh, this is the military base. That way. Right? See if there's anything about this tank. I wish I could drive this tank. I think the military base is up there, right? This is still the red trail. Can I get up in that tower just to see? Yeah, let's do that. Let's check out what's up here. What is this? VSS. Well, isn't that nice? And what is this? Handguard. VSS. Wow, my goodness. Loot Goblin Problems Return. Because... Does this... I don't have a magazine. It already has a scope, though. It is damaged. Let's look at the scope. Oh, is, is that a PU scope? P, no, that's PSO11, but it's kind of like the P. Well, we got to find room for it just to carry it because that's what I do. 
even though I don't know that we really need it for what we are doing. Mm, let's see, can I move this up here, move this here, lay this sideways, lay this sideways, move the map right here, and now do I have room? No, it's too long, it's got to go, it has to go up there, so this has got to come up. We'll do that. Sorry to make you watch me fidget with the inventory. I'm just going to hang on to this ESS yes, because, come on, that's a pretty cool gun. I know I don't have a magazine for it. Man, I don't have enough room for this. Okay. What are we going to get rid of? It's already damn. Do I have a gun cleaning kit? I do have a gun cleaning kit. Tell you what, let's just put it. Let's just put it on our back for right now. We'll mess with it later. I don't want the hand. No, we'll just carry the VSS. Well, that's a pretty cool thing. All right, now I got to make sure I get back on the red trail. Which is here. Okay. I've never shot that gun before. I guess I need to try to shoot it. What kind of ammo did it have? Nine by three nine. Do I have that? No, I don't have it. Man, I thought that was a person or a zombie right there. That stupid tree stump scared me because I was too busy looking in my inventory. Hey, there's another tower, too. Maybe we'll find a ammo for that. I'm pretty sure the base is up that way. Yep, there's another tower. Here's a way in. These are huge towers. Well, look at that. I don't have that pistol, but now I do have Yes, and I now have 10 shots. Semi-automatic, full automatic. I guess we're going to have to repair it. Okay, so now we have a worn select fire. Hmm, so marksman rifle fed from a detachable magazine battle with KA scopes using 9 by 3 9 rounds. Well, I have 10 of those. I don't have any else, right? I just checked. I don't have anything like that. So I'm pretty sure that's military rounds, right? All right, well, that's good. Got us a nice gun. Let's move on down the road, following the red trail. We'll get to this tower up here. What is this little thing? See, we're going to Dol Dolnika. Dol I can't say it. D O L N I K. Dolnik. Dolnik. Volnik?
That's a trail right there. That's not the way I'm supposed to go, is it? If I was following the red trail. Back to Polonia. Hmm. Wonder if that is. I'm still going to go this way because I want to go to the tower. not as big a tower as the other two but let's see what's up here okay there's another tower there Okay, nothing in the little towers. We're going to keep going down this road. Because I am supposed to be following the, the red trail. So, I don't know. It looked kind of like I should have went left back there. But, is that Nadbor way in the distance there? We're going to follow this dirt road. See where it takes us. It's a beautiful Livonia day. Look at the sun right there. We'll just let the road take us where it takes us. What do you do when you're having stamina problems? You pick up another gun and put it in your inventory. That is the wrong thing to do. Let's see, it looks like there's a clearing up ahead. Let's see what that is. Anyway, how is, is the weather at where you at? Uh, I, like I mentioned before, I live in Texas and we've been getting all kinds of storms and tornadoes. Uh, not, no tornado in my area, but the state of Texas has been getting some tornadoes. See, that's got to be... Um, is that the farm industrial area? Yeah, let me know. Have you been in an area where you've gotten some severe weather? Um, I know as far as tornadoes go, it's been Texas, Oklahoma, or some others further north. Um, hell storms and high winds have been going on. And we're a few weeks away from hurricane season. So then we're going to go into hurricane season. Which, at least with the hurricanes, they know uh, more days in advance that they're coming. Uh, tornadoes are very unpredictable. They just show up. Looks like I'm out in the complete wilderness, doesn't it? 
it wasn't for this road. Do we have something coming up here? I can't tell. We do. I think this is that. Uh, is this a factory? Let's see. Oh, that's a toxic zone. All right, let's go up here for a second. Let's get a better look at what's going on. Well, I don't have anything to go through that, so we're going to have to go around this. of toxic gas. There's either a dead zombie, dead player, I don't know what that is, but there's something dead right there. Okay. I think... I'm going to put the gun back. Yep, we gotta go around it. See if this is the right way to go around it. If I'm not mistaken, on the other side of this is where we'll meet back up with the red trail, I think. Starting to clear out as you get further this way. the main road there. Sounds like there's a deer up there. Let's see, do we got a sign right here? Sign that probably says, keep out. <laughs> Look at that, it does it. Keep out, military area. Yeah, well, I don't, I'm going to keep out because I can't go in there. All right, so should we go that way or is it this way that cuts through where we want to go? All right, we're going to go this way and it should connect us right back to the red trail to get us back onto our, our target destination. got to look for the markers and we should pick up oh we should pick the red trail up we'd like to come back there one day if I have the right gear and just kind of explore that area but that's not our mission for today
Okay. Let me just stop and take a drink. Where's my canteen at? Getting thirsty. Need to drink some water. Imagine carrying all this weight, you do get thirsty. Okay, look at that. There's a red trail. So we met back with the red trail. Let's see if the thing's in this car. Alright. Back on the red trail. I guess this is the red trail. It was easier to follow when it was actually a trail, not a road, a dirt road. You know, I don't want to uh, jinx myself, but I am really surprised I've not ran into any wolves yet. I remember when I first started playing, the wolves scared me to death. Just because, uh, you know, I was new, I didn't know anything. I think um, I was at, I think that little campground is Rex 6 or something like that. And I got in the little log cabin. There were wolves howling, and then I was ran from like three or four zombies, and then the wolves came, and there was like, it was kind of like uh, the Alamo. I was in this one little cabin. I was shooting wolves, shooting zombies. There's an explosion. All right, what do we got here? Something down there and something right here. Three oh eight. Don't I have some three oh eight? What is that down there? Is that worth it? I don't know if that's worth looking at. Let's keep going this way. I heard it. I think it's a deer that I heard. Sure hope it's not a bear. It sounds like a deer, right? No, you might not be able to hear it because I can barely hear it in the distance. So does the red trail cross over this road? Looks like it does. Okay, I've got to go up there and see those signs just to figure out where for a location. Nadbor's back that way, Limbrook, and yeah, see that rest, uh, what I, that's what I was just talking about, the WRZ, uh, that's where that little, where I was fighting the wolves, and I was fighting the zombies in that little house over there, yeah, we're going to keep following the red trip. I feel like that's going to have to be my next t-shirt um, um, in when I was in that Namaus tournament I kept saying I need more ammo I need more ammo that's going to be like my catchphrase now my new catchphrase is keep following the red trail I sure hope that's a deer not a bear
Okay, I feel like I can get closer. Okay, we're getting closer. I think we're at Dolinka. Dolink. So I need to go silent. Gotta kill some of these zombies. I need to put this gun up. Go ahead and eat. To eat some chicken before I take on some of these infected and get across to continue past this place. Okay. All right. I had to do a little bit of inventory cleanup. Now I'm going to go get back on the red trail. Don't need another rope. I could use some water. Do not, I have, no, I can go to any pond and get water. I have purification. Not really interested in a blaze. Did I kill that one? Toxic zone down that way. Could use some water, but I think I'm really close to where I need to be. So let's get up here just a little bit of ways. Check our ammo. Alright, this is the 20 rounds 380.
Okay. So, if that is the town of Dolink, then I should be really, really close. After months of traveling, dodging both the infected and other survivors, I find myself returning to a place ingrained in my memory. This land holds the lessons my father imparted to me, lessons of survival that have kept me alive. It's been an eternity since I last set foot here. This pond, where I once caught my first fish, still holds the same serene beauty. I can't wait to see him again. Father, it's Samantha. I am home. Where are you? Maybe he is out hunting. Father, where are you? I am here. Father? Oh God, no, it can't be. I'm so sorry, Father. I love you. Please forgive me. I have to think of Noah. If there's a place untouched by this madness, it might be where he is. I need to gather the strength to reach out to him, to find a way to establish contact. I have to try. Like, subscribe, and get notified.